Hello everybody! Today we're going to unbox and take a close-up look at the Sri Watana watch box. So let's go ahead and open up its outer box packaging. So in this box is a Sri Watana watch box. So it is a watch storage box for storing up to six wrist watches. And let's open up the box by of course cutting apart the clear sticky seal that's keeping the box securely closed and of course flipping up that box flap to reveal the contents inside and let's slide or pull that bubble wrap packaging with the Sri Watana watch box inside and of course just closing up the box after checking to make sure that nothing else is left inside we can set the watch box outer packaging on the side of the frame right there at the top and just sliding out the watch box now from its clear bubble wrap packaging and of course setting that cardboard card insert to the side and just making sure nothing else is left in the bubble wrap bag and just turning the watch box around so that it's in the upright or correct orientation in relation to the video. It's right there giving you a nice clear look at this wood Sri Watana watch box for storing up to six wrist watches. And okay, so now taking a closer up look at the watch box, so you can see it does have a clear lidded window. And of course, just taking a look on the underside and various aspects of this watch box. So you can see there is some graining to the sides and some striations as well with the wood grain and the tonality of that light to dark brown colouring right throughout the surface of the watch box. And of course taking a look at the underside as well. It does appear to have a black felt base cover right there, so giving you a close-up look to that material and covering on the underside of the watch box. So now I'm just going to run my fingers across that surface to give you some idea of the plushness of that material and how soft it is. So a nice soft felt-like material right there. In black and you can see it's finely covered perfectly around the base of the watch box. So taking a look at the front you can see that it does have a latch at the front with a bronze like finish and it is a hook type of latch right there that swings out and of course let's set the watch box down and lift up that lid now to reveal the inside of the watch box. So right there you can see six slots or compartments for up to six wrist watches of course or even bracelets and should you choose to remove the pillows from the slots you can store other smaller items in them. And of course just pulling out that watch box literature or user manual or user guide and giving you a nice clear look as well right there so just a single sheet of folded paper with the product literature so giving you a closer up look at the details of this Sri Watana watch box so it is a six watch storage box made from wood and you can see that it mentions that torch finish to create those green like striations. And I'm just going to set that on the left hand side of the frame so we can focus on the watch box itself. So giving you a closer up look at the inside and of course all the detail, as much detail as we can cover. So the pillows of the watch box, as you can see, have a jute-like 
covering to them. So as you can see right there, does have a very rustic design to it in terms of the softness or firmness of the pillow. So the sides are fairly stiff, whereas the main body of the pillow is medium in firmness. So just giving you a look there as I press down. So right there, giving you some sense of the softness for strapping your wristwatch or bracelet around those cushions. So giving you a look once again, so right there, with that clear window on the lid to look directly at all six watches. And it's nice to see that even the end slots have a nice full view through that window. So just setting it down and closing or latching that swing latch with that hook back down. So giving you a nice clear look. So just going to do some minor adjustments around the tabletop. So you have a nice unobstructed view of the Sri Watana watch box for six watches. So right there, giving you a nice good look at the overall detail. And so the striations are torched, so artificially created, but nonetheless still pretty, pretty nice in appearance. Right there. So handcrafted, at least some elements of it. And of course, taking a look at the hinge or hinges at the back of the box as well. So right there. And right there on the opposite side. So in terms of weight, the watch box is fairly light in weight for its size. But nonetheless, just giving you some idea in regards to the overall construction and design of this Sri Watana watch box. So right there. So giving you as much detail as I can. So even the corners as well and how those pieces are joined. And giving you a look once again at that swing latch fastener or this watch box lid. And that lid does stay in an upright position right there. So giving you a side view as well. So you have a good idea. And let's get the camcorder to focus right back on the watch box. So right there, giving you a nice good view. As I try and keep everything nice and tidy on the tabletop, as well as in the foreground. So once again, giving you a direct look inside and pulling out that twine-like or jute-like covering and lining inside the watch slots or compartments so right there. It's nice to see that the slots are very, very stiff. So giving you a look right there, hardly any flex and I'm definitely applying a fair amount of pressure onto the side so nice and rigid in construction in terms of the compartments or divider slots and of course giving you once again another look right here it's nice to see that very kind of natural rustic design with that vintage type effect Okay, so I'm just going to pop out once again, just giving you a better look with my hands and fingers out of the way at the cushion as well as the slots. So right there, giving you some better idea, hopefully, as to the overall design and look of this Sri Watana watch box. 
So taking a look on the underside of the lid as well, we can see that the border or bezel on the underside of that windowed lid is lined as well with that same twine-like or sack-like covering. Right there, just shutting that lid back down and simply making sure that it's secure right there. So nice and securely fastened with that swing buckle or latch. And of course, one last thing to do is to actually see the fitment with a watch inside, so giving you a better perspective and sense of size as well. And of course, one thing that I should do is to give you an idea right there with my hand covering the watch box giving you some sense of scale and once again perspective so and that's covering about two slots right there or two compartments of the watch box my hand right over the center or middle of the box and okay so let's open the box back up again and of course over here I have a Tudor Heritage Black Bay Harrods Special Edition Reference 79230G, which I've unboxed on the channel before, and it has a Georgia Straps French Nylon NATO Watch Strap, which I've unpacked on the channel before. This one is the navy and green, so you can always look up those two videos on the channel just by doing a simple search. So let's fit the watch, which has a 41mm case size, onto one of the cushions or pillows so let's do that so simply strapping the watch with that georgia straps french nylon nato watch strap in navy and green onto the pillow to give you a better idea in terms of size and fitment so 41 millimeters this watch case size is and let me just give it a quick wipe with this Marcellian ultra gentle cleaning cloth which I've also unpacked on the channel before just to keep the smears and smudges off that sapphire glass and giving you a nice clear clean look at the fitment of this 41 millimeter case size wristwatch on the Sri Watana watch boxes pillow so right there fitment in close-up detail so you have a good sense of size and compatibility with your wrist watches so right there just popping the watch down in the slot so just trying to keep it in the upright position so there is the moment of truth where you can see the width of the watch just about fitting with about a couple of millimeters or a millimeter and a bit on either side if i fit that perfectly in position so right there about a couple of millimeters right there from the edges or dividers of the compartment slots so nice good look overall and fitment even for a reasonably large watch such as this Tudor Heritage Black Bay Harrod Special Edition with its 41 millimeter case size so let's close the lid down and of course being safe and secure there by latching up that lid to make sure that the watch doesn't fall out from the box so giving you a look through that nice clear windowed lid and into the compartments of the watch box and of course just giving you some idea so that lid is actually made from glass as you can hear that sturdy clink as I tapped my finger on that glass window. So nice good look overall and nice and secure as well as you can see that jute type or twine type covering 
of the cushion or pillow and its lining does provide a good amount of grip as you can hear right there and giving you once again another look at the fitment overall and sizing of the watch with the pillow okay so right there and let's just pop the wristwatch right off and setting it to the side so once again right there nice and sturdy pillow that fits nicely and securely inside the Sri Watana watch boxes watch compartment and sliding or swinging that latch back down in the locked or closed position So giving you all the various aspects and angles of the Sri Watana watch box for storing up to six wrist watches. So that's the Sri Watana watch box. Thanks for watching and happy storing.